Hello, Times Crossword, let's go. Trainee in Rebel Element Ultimately. New. Time of day for a nonet to be reproduced. I'm wondering if that's afternoon because that's nine letters long and it's a time of day. And it's, well, I'm, go I'm coming back to that. I feel it could be right though. Sports club employee heading off, one delivering the goods, new. Mutiny aboard warship over service, requiring bishop. No. Bank employees least disturbed about most of parties' tall stories. No. Get up and go. It's a lot of nonsense. OK, I think we're in for a tricky one today. Scotsman. Yes. This is an, an old favourite for crosswords. Scotsman refers to Ian, which is a first name quite popular in Scotland. Consumed by great, consumed by GT. The abbreviation for great and a giant is a big monster. Doctrine. Surely dogma. A boxer. Well, a boxer is a dog. So that's boxer possibly. With university degree with MA, Master of Arts. It includes Judith. Well, I think that's the Apocrypha, books of the Bible which didn't make it into the, the official version. Potentially making Cora happy. Well, potentially making is an anagram indicator for Cora happy. Great A and O, that looks helpful. Notedly frenzied, so this looks like a musical direction. French film director recalled in past. Yeah, this is agitato, which means frenziedly as a musical direction. The French film director is tatty, T-A-T-I, recalled or reversed in past. Well, ago is past. Get up and go is drive. It's a lot of nonsense. Yes, drivel is nonsense. So a lot of drivel is its first five letters. Insectivorous, insectivorous bird, bee eater perhaps, biting female, yes, beef eater. So a bit of British general knowledge here. A bee eater is an insectivorous bird, biting female or including F, the abbreviation for female, and a beef eater is a name for one of the soldiers who guards the one of the royal buildings in London. I forget the name. It's, it's, where is it? It's close to Tower Bridge. I forget the name of the building, but they wear fancy, fancy costumes and they're called beef eaters. Now, 14 across. Commanding position. Well, this looks like it ends ship. of stationary items and fruit. Well, hip is the fruit, stationary items, the S just indicates the plural. Commanding position, no. Snag about maiden at a dance in Havana. Well, Havana is the capital of Cuba, so I think we're looking for a Cuban dance, maiden is likely to be M, the cricketing abbreviation. Snag. About maiden. I'm thinking M is here and snag is a three-letter word. And then at A refers to the final A. Restrict meat, that's surely ham. Butcher, finally, provided in scam. No, so I must bear in mind that this M could be wrong. Qualified medic participating in my jazz group. No, reportedly a girl's 
cereal. Yeah, Mrs. This is Mays. M A Y is the girl, a girl's name, and reportedly indicates that it's spelt differently to how it sounds. So Mays, M A Y apostrophe S, sounds like Mays, the cereal crop. One praising corporal, perhaps, by Main Road in Orient. No. Muslim sect, one with post. Yeah, well, no. I was going to say Ismaili. I think this may be right, actually. I think I thought there may be an H in it, but let's see if this works. So I think Ismaili is a Muslim sect. One is one. Post is male in Southern Ireland. Sorry, in Southern Isle in S and I, the abbreviations. Qualified. Medic, medic could be MB or MO, participating in my jazz group. Wow, not getting that. Saw, I think this is gnome. A saw is, an, is a saying and a gnome is a saying, although it's fairly obscure. And the gnomes of Zurich is a reference to bankers in Switzerland. So I don't have 17 yet. Let's have a look at that. Banker. Okay, there you go. That looks like the definition. Bird enthusiast. Entertaining at home. Yeah, this is financier. So a financier is a banker. A bird enthusiast is a fancier, as in a pigeon fancier. Entertains at home. Entertains in so that fully explains 26 across because the definition is financier in Zurich, perhaps. 13 down. Repeated strikes. Buffeting. Are repeated strikes. In cafeteria, buffet. In is in. The centre of Basingstoke is, Basingstoke is the central letter of Basingstoke, which is G. One praising. I wonder if this is encomiast, which is somebody who delivers an encomium, which is a poem or song of praise. Corporal is NCO, a non-commissioned officer in the British Army. And an NCO isn't only a corporal, hence corporal perhaps. By main road, by the M1, a motorway in Britain, in Orient, in East. Now, no more help with 20 down and none needed. So, a qualified medic is an MB. Participating in my, ah, this is my, the interjection as in my or coup. And then a combo is a jazz group. Book, space, yes, this is broom. So book is B, the abbreviation, space is room. And a broom is a cleaning utensil. Time of day, surely afternoon. I might have to come back at the end to justify this, but it fits the letter pattern. Check, fight, bringing amenity for skiers. I want to say chairlift, but I'm not understanding the, the word play. Diversions. Of French at City on Loire. Of French is usually D-E. But what diversions begin D-E-T? Don't know. Weary. Yeah, weary is tired. Chap is Ted, just a man's name. With grasp or including Irish. I-R is the abbreviation for Irish. Now... Three letters in three down. Sports club employee, surely ending man, heading off, one delivering the goods. Gosh, not getting that. 
mutiny aboard warship over service requiring bishop gosh no bank employees least disturbed that looks like an anagram of least about most of parties tall stories i'm wondering if this ends tales which fits in with tall stories being the definition and also tales is an anagram of least so bank employees i wonder if those are tellers least disturbed no the bank employees are the outside letters about most of parties tall stories not getting this however the all of the unclued all of the unsold clues are connected so no orphan areas of the grid and more letters in clues to look at so touching down landing between flights, well, between flights of stairs, you have a landing. Liberal leaves Indian city, securing good, likely to be G, character in Patras. I've never heard of Patras. Is it a city? Don't know. Or a book? So what we're looking for is L for liberal, leaving a five-letter Indian city. And then putting that around G. I think I need more help. Again, lost at sea. Great. A nice straightforward anagram. So at sea is the anagram indicator for again lost. And nostalgia is looking back regretfully. So 16 down. Restrict, hamper, meet, butcher finally, provided in scam. Not getting that. American associated with bird, book. So American is usually AM or US. And associated just means linked with. So American could be at the beginning or the end of the word. What if it was at the end? Character in Patras. What is this? Aha, uh -huh, I'm thinking this is Sigma. So I'm guessing that Patras is a Greek city, in which case a character in a Greek city would be could be sigma, a Greek letter. So, how does the wordplay work? Liberal leaves. So, I think Simla, S-I-M-L-A, is an Indian city. Leave out the L, put it around the G, and you get sigma. American associated with bird book. Yes, a tit is a bird. So American, US, associated with tit, gives Titus, which is a book in the New Testament. Now, surely 16 down, and the M may not be correct. Restrict, hamstring, yes. Meat is ham. Butcher, finally, is the final letter of butcher. Provided in scam, provided in sting. So, 14 minutes down. M is correct. Game. Girl brought up in a fantasy kingdom. Wow. Ah, yes, of course. Ruritania. So, game is RU, the abbreviation for rugby union. Girl brought up. 
How is this working? Yeah. Girl is Rita. Brought up in is reversing in. A is A and Ruritania is a fantasy kingdom in a book created by, I think, Anthony Hope. Now, one orphan clue here. Snag, rub, about Maiden, about M, and the rumba is a dance in Havana. Not the samba or the mamba. Now, closing in, however, I think all of these clues are ones I've looked at. Commanding position. Could that be major ship? Of stationary items, majors, nope. So what are stationary items? Pens, papers. That's it. Okay. So what haven't I looked at? One down with this T. Trainee in, yes, cadet. Phew. So a cadet is a trainee. Cade, I think Jack Cade was a rebel, either in a book or in history or in mythology, which pretty much covers everything. And then element, ultimately, the last letter or ultimate letter of element is T. Great, C and D, those look jolly useful letters. Check. Yes, check is CH, the abbreviation. And then flight is airlift. And a chairlift is an amenity for skiers. So diversions of French. I guess that could be DU or DE. But that doesn't give us more than we had before. Sports club. Ah, yes, this is roundsman. So the sports club employee is a groundsman. The person who looks after the grounds. Heading off without its initial letter. And then a roundsman is a tradesman who deliver goods by going on rounds. So that's one delivering the goods. So one more letter in nine across. Diversions, detours. Yes, not diversions as in amusements, but diversions as in traffic diversions. Of French is DE and tour is a French city, and I guess it must be on the River Loire. So, one, two, three clues to go. Mutiny, insubordination. Fantastic. Always good to get the long ones in, but usually more helpful at the beginning of the, of the solve. Now, so insubordination is mutiny. Aboard warship. A board warship is in sub, as in in a submarine, over service, over ordination. Yeah, I guess an ordination is a, relig a religious service which has to be conducted by a bishop. So that's the word play for that. Aha, uh -huh. rulership. Yeah, rulers are stationary items and rulership is a commanding position. One clue to go. Bank employees, and I'm thinking tellers, least disturbed is tales about, aha, uh -huh, yes, travellers' tales. So bank employees are tellers, the T at the beginning, and then, and then ellers. Least disturbed is an anagram of least to give tales about most of parties, about most of rave. And then travellers' tales are tall stories or stories which aren't to be relied on as totally true. So there we go. Now, I did not fully explain two down. 19 minutes down. Let me have a quick look at this. Time of day. Afternoon is a time of day. For a non -et, Oh, wow, this is just an anagram of for a non-et. Let me just check that. A-F-T-R. Yep. So D to be reproduced is just an anagram indicator for for a non-et, and that gives afternoon. So there we go. Every clue solved. Every clue explained. No empty squares. Submit. Submit. Hope and pray. No errors. Fantastic. Wow. 
What a puzzle. That was a real challenge. And it took me about 10 clues to even get the first one in. So I was expecting it to be a bit of a beast. But gradually, as more clues fell into place, I think the soul sped up and in total just under 20 minutes. So absolutely fantastic fun and another beautiful puzzle from the times. In terms of a snitch perspective, I would say that's probably in the 70s or 80s. So a good challenge, but not brutally hard. I hope you enjoyed watching that solve. Like and subscribe and I will see you next time.